You defeated a Thunderjaw? That's what you sent me to do. We sent you for answers. Have the machines stopped coming through the settlement? Well, then I guess I found your answers too. Possibly. Radell? These components were made by the old ones. These... these were made by an Osirum tinker. Osirum? And yet Uruk went to Mother's Tears and Nora territory. Mother's Tears is a settlement in Valley Mead. The Nora abandoned it during the Red Raids. The Nora can't be behind this, can they? The Nora are far too superstitious about the old ones to touch a device like this. And what is that device? It's a high-frequency wireless communication system. A beacon, but for machines. Hmm. So, that's why Avad's spymaster came all the way out here. You knew you'd find this. I didn't know. I feared. And decisions shouldn't be based on fear. Facts should lead us. So try sharing some facts. The few small lures I've seen have the power to attract only a handful of machines from close by. But this, if there are more of them, then this is a threat to the whole sun. And you think it's a good idea to say all that in front of a shadow Karja? When I found that lure, it was connected to the old one's rooms to a uh, big metal bowl. <laughs> Could that have made this lure more powerful? But why did Urid ignore the lure and follow whoever it is back to Nora territory? What's so important about these people? You served in Mother's Tears, didn't you, Reyes? I served where I was sent. Yes, I served there. Then you know the land. The wounds of the Red Raids are still fresh for the Nora. Valley Meat would be an extremely dangerous place for a Shadow Kaja to go. Though, if Urid felt these people were important enough to pursue, we must too. Go on for your brother, for the vow you made to the Sundom, or for yourself. But if you choose to go, do it as a free man. Ah, that's so sweet. His luminance Avad won't send Kaja soldiers into Nora territory, but I cannot stop someone going there to find their brother. Oh. Walk in the light, Reyes, but try not to be seen. But I will go to Mother's Tears and find Orid, as a free man. First, I'll need to make a rope dart. That's the only way I'm going to cross the bridge into that settlement. More climbing. <laughs> I'm actually glad. Like, I'm really enjoying this way of doing things. I don't know why I did not like the climb as a game. Maybe it was not as smooth as this, because this is, like, perfect. There's literally nothing wrong with the movement and just what the devs did here. <laughs> it's so impressive. All right, I installed some Velcros. I'm not sure if that's gonna be enough, but I feel more free, if that makes sense. So that's gonna be a new climbing tool. Rope darts before now. No need to be nervous, Reyes. Nervous for what? I should grip the rock. I have a diploma. Is that not correct? I got it. One step closer. Looks right. I have to wind the handle binding. Just a bit further. What is this even? There, 
That should help me cross into Mother's Tears, into Nora territory. I'll have to be careful. I don't think we have all the stuff happening with people here. Like, she's not gonna craft swords for me, and the other one, food. So we are just on our way. Does that seem like a halfway point? Hmm. We'll see. Ah. We're going there finally. <laughs> Territory and mother's tears I haven't been here since the war. I need to find a word in the Osram he was tracking. Whatever they've got planned for those machine wars can't be good. Rats in the snow. I thought this is the end game part, or maybe. Something else in the store. That'll keep me going. I still wish we would have like an equipment for it, but it's fine. We still have nothing. Oh wow. <laughs> That's a lot of climbing to do. Unless we're going there, that's more reasonable. The Matriarch's Lodge is the settlement's biggest and most defensible building. The Osra might have set up there. We should take a look. So, what do we do with this? Okay, it's creating ropes for us. That's nice. This scale is still kind of on the way, but... Rod kept his word. I'm free. So why do I still feel like I'm carrying a bird? I'm kind of like... Pinching it through my right ear, and that seems to be working for now. But I'll have to think about something else. <laughs> That's pretty cool. It. <laughs> well, maybe that was not the way. Uh huh, that's why. <laughs> Rematch. Now I'm comfortable with the setup, so. Watchers. Snaking pile could be easier than fighting. That grass would give me cover. I don't think you know with who you are talking with. Fast. 
sneaking by? What is it? Sprint or so? That was cancelled? <laughs> I need to look for all supplies for the arrows. Main gate's just ahead. <sighs> Made it. Not really. <laughs> Oh, I can't kill them. In the arm of Jiron. That siege engine must have pulled the settlement gates open. I can't switch my hands with it. Oh, I see. So what's the main goal of the game? To see who's turning on those satellites? Because I thought the Thunder Joe was going to be the last boss. Mind me. Repeating yourself, Rias. Gotta move. Hit in the eye. So far, so good. <laughs> So there are stuff in those barrels, okay. Good to know it was not pointless. Got it. I still got nothing. Oh, there's a split. 
these cliffs. I think my gameplay is stable for now. At least I feel good about it. Not perfect, but what's new here? I'll be glad to hit headshots on them. I'll take that blaze. There was a passage. If the Mage Fairy's Lodge, I cross this next area, I can get to it. Hold on, I'll launch us around here. To the Osram Lord. I see them. There, I should be in cover. Let's start the fun. It's done it. They're so weak. Maybe I can release that cage up there. Do you have something? Abu. Aha. We can also go down, I suppose. 